I'm Rita Foley with an AP News Minute. Hamas says it's close to reaching a deal to release some of those taken hostage by the group in its October 7th attack on Israel that triggered the war. But now there's a warning from the World Health Organization. We are seeing a complete collapse of the of the higher level infrastructure of the Gaza health system. WHO Emergencies Chief Dr. Michael Ryan says the concentration of refugees is driving up the risk of epidemics. It really has been heavy rain. It has flooded a lot of the makeshift camps and it is generating all kinds of risks. Ryan says only 10 of Gaza's 36 hospitals are now functioning in any way at all and will likely be overwhelmed in the coming weeks. I'm Ben Thomas. Millions of Americans are expected to hit airports and highways in record numbers over the Thanksgiving holiday. 55 million of us expected to travel. The busiest days to fly will be today and Wednesday, as well as the Sunday after Thanksgiving. I'm Rita Foley.